Shalom walking first all praise and glory to Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai Bahashim Raga Kodash Dabwana Padnilsum and Slash Pelek Well let's base up real quick in a second My audio will kick in <laughs> Same man But I want to get a listen on real quick Base up bro How in this truth you must always keep pushing forward Regardless man <laughs> Because at the end of the day You're looking back man You're looking back on the world on like, yeah, no, bro, you know, fuck up. You know, something we're gonna fuck up, man. You know, about that, that, bro. Not saying you should, not saying you you should fuck up, but it's like, it's gonna happen. Don't send the most side, you know, the most side knows your attention, bro. But all that matters, really, is what are you gonna do today to improve? Because yesterday, it already happened, bro. It already did. Or the, what are the mistakes yesterday already happened, bro? All right, man. Yeah, that's, that's the truth it is, bro. But what are you going to do today? That will really well matter. So what's the action you do today, man? Because, hey, you come in the kind of uh, complete fuck before, bro. But if you fix yourself now, if you keep trying to improve, that's, something, that's, really, that's the biggest thing the Lord wants, bro. If we want you to improve, man, always could be always pushing forward and improving. <laughs> You have that plow, man. Yeah, you you keep you keep going, bro. You don't look but you keep going, man. <laughs> this Luke 9 verse 62 means the hell shall I send to him? No man looking back is having his pound to the plow. Looking back is fit for the kingdom of Yahweh. So hey bro, just keep pushing, bro. Honestly, then they just keep pushing. Because honestly, already like, be honest, bro. There ain't nothing back in the world. There ain't really nothing there, bro. There's not a single fucking thing for you to really it's like. What about that? What about this, man? Honestly, you're only really honest. You probably weren't doing shit back then before, bro. That's, honestly, that's pretty much the truth. You probably weren't doing shit back then, or we weren't doing anything really meaningful. Like, yeah, you probably could make a bit more money. Probably had a bit more better job, better relationship, better relationship with your family, or woman, this, that, or the other, right? But it's but the salvation, bro. That trumps it all, bro. That truly trumps all of that. So always keep pushing forward, bro. It's First Corinthians one verse ninety four. I mean, know, know you yet that know you not that they which run and race run run all, but one received the prize. So run that you may obtain. So hey, bro, keep pushing forward, man. You gotta realize, bro. You gotta be, you gotta think like, you gotta, you gotta take it, man. You gotta keep pushing forward and keep taking, just keep taking the blows. Keep hitting, keep throwing the, keep going the flows, bro. Keep pushing. You're like, all right, at the end of the day, yeah, all right, I got this, I got, I, you know, this shit happened, this shit happened, but are you gonna stay down? Are you gonna just run out of breath and just stay where you are? Or are you keep going, man, and learn from it? <laughs> but you know when to say the truth can be easy. Your brother is constantly said, hey, it's truly be difficult. Hey, it's truly be difficult. Hey, you might, lo- might lose a lot of things, man. You might lie and lose shit than, than you even think that, you ha- that you're going to lose. Like, honestly, like I said, you could lose a lot of things, bro. Your job, woman, housing, money, bro, family, children. And not saying, like, oh, yeah, they're going to leave. No, no, it might, it might affect you. It might affect you bigger than you realize. Say, so. Hey, so it's gonna be a hard thing, bro. But if you keep running, man, keep running, most of the part like you receive that prize at the end. Where all everything you went through was worth it, man. Make all the hell, all the shit you go through worth it at the end day. Don't just back out now, man, because then you lost it for nothing. It's an every man strike every man strike for the mastery is temperate in all things. Now they do to attain a credible crown, but we are incredible. So there, I therefore so run not as uncertainty, so fight I not as one that be the air. <laughs> so, hey, but we say we are we are uncertain, or we're, we're running, bro. We are uncertain, like oh, I kill maybe this and that, and it's no shut up boxing, bro. This is a true, this is a true fight, man. Make all that blood, sweat, and tears. Make every single moment that he has suffered, man. Worth it, bro. Keep pushing for it, man. Because if you back out now, if you back out now, then 
then what was it all for? What was it, all the pain, all the heartache, all the blood, sweat, and tears for then? If you didn't go straight back into it, man. You could have, you could never, you could have just kept flying by in the world. And I still had all that shit, but now you lost it. Now you had, now you lost it. Try to change for salvation. Then you went back straight to the shit, man. Then now you have fucking nothing. So, hey, bro, honestly, just keep pushing, bro. Just keep pushing, man. That's, all, that's really good to only do, bro. Keep pushing. Don't look back. Don't like, oh, fuck, bro. Like, you know. It's just that and the other. Like, no, don't look back, man. There ain't nothing there for you. The six you did. Oh, well, that was, that was before, bro. All what should matter now is what you do now. <laughs> Be the only offense. This, the truth is going to be hard, bro. The truth is going to be hard. For Lord, I'm pushing the above you right able, man. The Lord knows what what you can handle, what you can't handle. The Lord ain't going to push what you can't handle. He didn't build you up. He has to build you up first. This is 1 Corinthians 10, verse 13. And read there, no, temptation, no temptation is taken to you. But as such as, but as is, said, but such as is common to man, but Yahweh is faithful. The Lord is faithful, bro. The Lord knows your limits, man. He know He made you. He made you, bro. He made you. He knows your limits. He knows when to stop, when to let go of the break, when to turn off, when to turn off the, the um the kettle, man. So, but Yahweh is is faithful, who will not suffer you be. To be tempted above your able, who not suffer above your able, but will, with the temptation, also make a way to escape, that you may be able to bear it. And not, it might not come in a way that you want it. It may not come that, oh, I wanted this, but hey, you didn't get it, man. But hey, you are able to bear all the hell and temptation the Lord will give unto you. Lord knows your limits, no Lord knows your strengths, no Lord, Lord knows your weaknesses. So if you give up now, man, honestly, if you give up now, you you basically gave up because you you're just weak, you're just weak, you weak, you had the weak mindset, man. Be Lord and give more than you handle, so you what's there to fear? At the end, what's there to fear when you get when you go through the hell? And yeah, I mean, I'll be honest, bro. Sometimes all the hell, it, it gets it gets heavy, bro. And it will get heavy, man. I'm not saying that, oh, you know, why are you, why are you bitching down, bro? Like, what the fuck? You're like, yeah, you know, the hell does get heavy sometimes. And sometimes I feel like, in fact, I can get that real quick. <laughs> the strange thing happened onto you. You are you being. The spell rope. Suck you. <laughs> it will feel like sometimes, like, oh, like, more like. It's like a, a strange thing happened to you, but at the end of the day, it's just the hell you had to go through, bro. You have this come at you, you have that come at you, you have this, that, and the other, like, fuck, man, like, what the fuck, what am I gonna do? You're like, well, fuck, bro. But right at the day, you just be, you just be, you just be pushing, bro. You gotta have, honestly, at the end of the day, you gotta have that winter spirit, man. You gotta have one, they can't. Like, yeah, at the end of the day, yeah, you know you're going to catch hell. You know this is going to happen. You know, we're not going to live luxurious lives, right? But you can't be the, oh, you know, what's well, going to happen? It has to happen, bro. Like, yeah, like, hey, yeah, it's going to happen. But are you just going to just lie down there and take it? Like, you're like, shit, like, if you know like, you're going to die, like, shit, like, at least take it. At least push it, bro. Like, at least fucking, they got a, a blaze of gold in your shit, man. They like, well, no, they can't be like, oh, well, I love, you know, this is Lord. They're like, yeah, it's the Lord wants you to take it. Like, the Lord wants you to take it, bro. But yeah, but we gotta honestly have a winner spirit, man. You gotta be a winner, man. Can't be a loser. We gotta be a winner. It's like, beloved, it's like this first Peter's first, before verse 12, it's beloved, taking not strange concerning the fire trial, which is to try you as though some strange, some strange thing happened unto you. But yeah, it's gonna be pushed, it's gonna help, it's gonna push you into that. Like, fuck all this shit, bro. But then there you gotta just, just realize, hey, this is hell. That's all it is, it is hell. Keep pushing forward, man.
be honest, and the, the biggest enemy is you, and you have like a weak mind state. That's gonna be asking you don't have that. Well, like, even if that was a camp, bro, the whole world was me, what was me. Like, yeah, man, you're gonna go through hell. No, it's, it's not gonna feel, it's not gonna feel good 100% of the time, and honestly, some of the battles you might lose. Like, speak myself personally, man, because you might, might feel good down, bro. You might be down, man. But at the end of the day, hey, argument. You gotta realize this is the Lord has me. That's all how the Lord wants it. Just keep striving for it. Keep pushing for it. Make God's determined in this thing. Make all make all, that shit like when you're feeling down. Make like you know what this is the world Lord wants you to and make all this fucking hell worth it. I'll make all the emotional feeling worth it, bro. But that's what I can't, bro. This is time of all people to go to your house, Bahashim, your shy Bahashim, Kardash, and suck him slow.